I'm with Linmont. We produce a, a linear motor, which is very unusual. It, it is, it's electromagnetically driven. We don't have belts, gears, uh, cams, nothing like that. It's all electromagnetically, direct drive. Simplicity of design gives us a very long life. We expect the motor to run about two billion cycles when properly applied. We have forces from 10 pounds all the way up to 600 pounds. Everything about the motor is controllable. Another thing that makes it very unique. Velocity is controllable, max velocity, uh, max acceleration, deceleration, even force and positioning. We use Hall Effects transducers, which are monitoring the position of magnets in our slider, which gives us a repeatability of two thousandths of an inch. We can go to four ten thousandths if we use an encoder. Primary things that we're known for, very high speeds, up to 175 inches per second, controllability, and long life. You can instantly change it by using a, a, an interface and we can go to a much different move. As I mentioned, everything about the motor is controllable. We have controllers that can store up to 250 different moves or combinations of moves. So we can instantly change dynamics to an entirely different application.